Hi, and welcome to Gusaman. If you're looking for a quick way to make 3D characters that you can easily generate using text prompts, which can now be rigged on Mixamo for animations on social media or for characters you can use in games, this is a tutorial for you. First things first, you need to go to a site called lumalabs.ai. Links for this will be put in the description below for this video. Once you are there, the next thing you need to do, click on the options by the side, these three dots, and go to Genie. Once you are in Genie, all you have to do is click on this. It's going to take you to the Discord page. So you see that you're registered already, or once I'm here, if you don't have an account, all you have to do is register, open the Discord account, and you get access to the server. I'm already on the server, so I don't need to do anything else. It is free. Then next stage is click on any of the genies, scroll down and click on any of the genies on the left side of the panel. You'll find genie one, genie two, genie three, any of these will work. Click on this genie, I prefer to use genie one and I can go ahead and type. You will see other people are on the server, people are generating, it's a public server. So whatever work you do will be pasted for everyone to see. And it's a good way for the community to share prompting styles that work and what works. So we want to create a character that can be easily rigged, which is we want to add something in T-Pose and something cool, right? And easy. I realize that short prompts work better than long prompts on this particular server. I'm going to type in prompt, me Johnny style. All you have to do is come into the message, click on it, type forward slash, and you're going to get options. It's going to help you out. All you have to do is click on the first one, Genie prompt. And then you're going to type the prompt you want. You're going to type wacky, cute, funny, cartoon, character. But we want it to be uh, rigged. We're, we're making a character that will be rigged for animation. So we're going to do comma, T, pose. T pose is a way you design characters in 3D so that people can easily rig it. The riggers can easily rig it properly. So every part of the model is exposed for rigging. So click on T pose, we'll hit our enter and then we'll watch the server do its thing. And in a few minutes, you're going to get characters posted. Me, Johnny Style 2. Four characters which you can decide to say if you like it all you have to do is refine any of the characters you want or you can roll the dice again by clicking this and hope it generates something new let's click on refine number one which looks a bit decent this will take a while so we're gonna wait so once the characters are refined. It's called refining. Once they have been refined, you will get them in a higher resolution up close. You can go ahead now and just click on view and download where you can download. Take you take you to a side separate platform where you can view the character and download. They are really high quality. It just like you know like it's still getting there, and so you can just choose the format you want. I prefer FBX and I'll just download. And then we'll go back to get the second one, view, download. Just like that, we have 3D characters. All we had to do was type a text on a platform and wait for the results, right? And just like that, we have characters designed for us, all from typing a text on a platform for free. And we can go ahead and take them to other platforms like Mixamo to rig and then bring them to Blender for animations. So if you want a more advanced tutorial, I'll be doing more advanced tutorials on this topic. So please follow my page, like, subscribe, and I'll keep posting more on this. I'll do a more advanced tutorial on this. And if you have any questions, please put in the comment and I'll get back to you. Thank you and a happy new year.